Hey folks, hope you're doing well. It's been a while since I've ranted about anything other than music theory and composition, that kind of stuff that I find particularly very interesting. Uh, so I just thought since I've got a few minutes, thought I'd share with you a few things that I've been thinking about lately. There's a lot of crap going on in the world at the moment, and that's not that that has... And it can be very, 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 very disheartening and very frightening and very depressing. You know, there's, there's no way around that. That's just, it's just true. A lot of really, if you'll pardon the expression, dangerous shit going down these days. And it's very often easy to feel powerless with... All the th about all the things that are going on, and again, I'm what I'm not saying. What I'm saying is nothing that isn't clear and very, far more eloquently said by a lot of people than other than me. But I wanted to share this with you. A few years ago, I had a a book of like aphorisms from around the world. Um, and there was one that was associated with, uh, I think it was called a Chinese proverb. And it's, uh, it's one that I think has, I found to be very helpful in a lot of ways over the years. And it's really just four words. And those four words are chop wood and carry water. Chop wood and carry water. And I, and I think that says a lot of I that those four words remind us that you know if you chop wood, you'll have wood for fire to keep you warm at night. If you chop wood, you'll have fire to cook a meal with. If you carry water, you got something to drink. If you carry water, you can have a bath or help someone do their laundry or whatever. And it's these simple, direct kinds of advice that I think is useful, particularly these days when there's so much that's overwhelming. Right, and they're just—you seem like they're powerful, they're powerless to do things about. And may I suggest that keeping things like chop wood and carry water in mind might help, because chopping wood and carrying water are simple, direct things that you can do, that you can do. To improve your immediate situation or the immediate situations of people around you. Now, that's right. We have very little control over much of what goes on in the world. But in our little corners of it, our little corners of heaven or whatever you want to call it, we can make very, very positive very immediate, very obvious, and very satisfying differences to people. Yeah. You know, for example, you know, if you're... I have some elderly women who live in this building, and occasionally I'm going out when they're coming in with big loads of groceries, and they're tired and they're not in the best of health and they have to drag a bunch of groceries up three flights of stairs and I was there and I'm there to help them every now and again without even thinking I, without even at without I've gotten to a point where where I don't even have to ask them they'll say they'll just look at me and will ask me like uh, 
you know, as if to say, would you help us? And I can't. I can, in that instance, be of direct, positive help in a very small, infinitesimal way for somebody else. And that, it, 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 it reminds me that, yeah, well, maybe I am basically where I should be. You know, basically where I am, I, could, I can be around, available to help in very direct, very personal, very small ways. Yeah. There's a, if you'll pardon the expression, there's a whole lot of shit going down these days. And it's much of it has staggeringly bad implications. And we can't do much about it as individuals. But in our own private spheres, in our own private worlds of whatever, how many miles you travel every day, there are places where you can make a difference where you can and should and make direct, positive, immediately beneficial actions that you can take. Chop some wood. Carry some water. It'll probably improve your outlook. Just a thought. Hopefully that... Uh, to Oh, just an idea, something I've been thinking about. Yeah, there's a lot going on. But we're here, and we can help. See you later.